All right, friends and family, here at uh, Oakland Cemetery, we're over here now at section two. Uh, off to my left-hand side, um, off to your left-hand side, uh, we have the, the headstone of Miss Catherine Ghiaschetti. Uh, and I apologize if I mispronounce that. Um, you can correct me in the comment section below. Um, what we believe to have happened with this headstone is that uh, during the winds that we had, it actually fell down. So, um, what we did is we used our pinch tool to kind of raise the stone up and then we put these rollers under it because it's a very heavy stone and uh, using these plastic PVC pipes will actually prevent damage to the face when we try to move it. So, um, and we have to make a decision of what we're going to do with the stone. But long and short, here's the headstone. When it went to the ground, we propped these under. We effectively rolled it. Um, I don't know if we're giving any of the uh, secrets away of how they built the pyramids, but we've got these pretty nice PVC pipes. Um, we were able to roll the headstone off. Our goal right now is we're going to raise the foundation and the base. Uh, once we do that, we're gonna put solid fill on the bottom, and then uh, we'll make a plan uh, from there. Um, as far as what we're going to do with the actual headstone itself. So we'll uh, catch us here, raising the stone. And um, also, if you uh, hear anything else in the background, it's other wonderful volunteers that came up to help clean up and maintain the cemetery. So we'll see you in a little bit. Look. You look good, man. He's got the same name you do. Steve. That's right. and Don. Steve and Don. They're on break right now. Are you ready? Ready. All right, let me get it focused. All right, that's the best I'm going to be able to do. All right, sounds good. So, uh, Sean and Steve back again and saw two amazing uh, volunteers. Uh, on the first clip. Um, so right now, <laughs> we had um, our foundation stone was in place, and then uh, Miss uh, Catherine uh, Gia Getty. So Gia Getty's stone is upright. Um, we actually had to change our eight foot tripod to the 10 foot tripod. The reason being is when we raise this stone, it has to clear the height and then we'll reset it onto the actual base foundation itself. So uh, we're gonna do that right now, and then uh, we'll see you in the next cut. Same two guys, they're on break again, and we're over here trying to reset this stone. Y'all wanna say hi? No, I want y'all to keep down the noise. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, buddy. Doing some fine work over here. Thank you. I and, see uh, that. We are, uh, back at uh, Miss Catherine um, and I was actually um, incorrect about this so Catherine Desmond D-E-S-M-O-N-D -E um, she was the wife of uh, Peter Giagetti uh, so we have her stone upright uh, one of the things that we did while the headstone was off the foundation uh, Mr. Harmon put the epoxy on the base um, and then when we set the um, headstone back down, we verified no squeeze out because if there was a squeeze out of the epoxy, we would just clean it up. And then um, 
one of the things that we pointed out in previous videos, this uh, nice set of poinsettias was uh, actually captured under the headstone. So uh, when you have decorations and whatnot, just put them back the way you found them. And so that is back to where it was. And we're expecting a lot of rain here in the next couple days. So what you see as far as this headstone goes, uh, because it was actually flat in the ground, it should clean up pretty well. And then later on we'll do our mechanical cleaning with the nylon brush and just water. And then uh, if we have to hit it with a D2 or the wet and forget, that's something we'll capture in the later uh, video. Um, if, you, if you look to your left, uh, we have the, um, the headstone of Raphael Giagetti. And uh, one thing that we noticed, since we're already here and we had all our equipment, um, this stone was leaning forward. Uh, so if you looked at it from the side, it was leaning forward. So what we decided to do is that we're going to go ahead and raise and reset that stone while we're here. And um, look, what it looks like is that there's a foundation with some minor roots around it. So we're going to raise the foundation, uh, give it a solid base, and then reset the stone on top and probably clean off the base. And uh, we'll make a decision whether we put the epoxy on there or not. So we'll catch you in the next cut. Uh, family and friends of uh, Oakland Cemetery, uh, we're back at Raphael Giagetti's um, stone here in section two. Um, we lowered the stone down onto the foundation. The only thing is we're going to use these two wooden picks to basically uh, set the headstone stationary. And the reason we do that is because even though the stone is uh, in contact with the foundation, there's a, a layer of, of epoxy that's going to be squeezed out and that may offset the leveling just a little bit. It's not so much of a big deal for the smaller stones, but for your larger stones, like we have for Catherine Giagetti stone, um, we want to make sure that the uh, epoxy is set solid. Um, epoxy set solid, and, and at the same time, the two wooden picks are going to hold it uh, in place. What's going to happen over the next couple days when the epoxy is solid, we'll verify the level and then just remove the picks, and then we should be good to go, and you're going to have a straightened out stone. Uh, we're here at our final. Uh, set up for uh, Catherine Giagetti, who's uh, off to your right, and then uh, Raphael uh, Giagetti, who is uh, right next to me uh, to your right. Um, both the stones have been raised and reset, uh, both foundations. Um, uh, Mr. Harmon placed the epoxy between the headstone and the foundation, so uh, we verified level on Catherine's, and we actually have it propped up, and then for the smaller stone, for Raphael, um, we have, uh, we only had to put one of the bracing bars to the front of it and uh, with the weight of the stone alone, uh, that's going to hold it level and then what's going to happen over the next couple days, um, uh, one, the rain's going to come down, you'll probably have a cleaner effect on uh, Miss Catherine's stone and then um, we'll come back to this stone later on but our main objective which is to raise and reset the stones and here we are on another successful raise and reset. Uh, one thing. If you have any questions or comments, leave it in the comment section below. Give us a like and subscribe, and we appreciate your support.